A neighborhood in Hartford is celebrating a milestone. Nine months with no fatal shootings. The Greater Hartford NAACP believes it's thanks to a weekly program directly engaging the community. NBC Connecticut's Kevin Geis has the story from Barber Street. A small celebration for violence prevention. We've been try here trying to dispute, negate, and stop the issues that are happening here in the Greater Hartford area. Reverend Dr. Bruce Carter considers Barber Street in Hartford home. For the last nine months, he and the Greater Hartford NAACP have been hosting Wake Up Wednesdays. We've been here through rain, I mean literally snow, sleet, every single Wednesday for nine months. They say their work has led to a halt in fatal shootings. There hasn't been one along Barber Street in Hartford, according to the NAACP, since a string of eight murders led to the creation of Wake Up Wednesdays. I think it's very important for us to serve the people and getting that, 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 that engagement with them, letting them know that, that they're not out here by themselves. The event offers food, clothing, resources, or just a listening ear for members of the community looking to engage. Greater Hartford NAACP President Corey Betts says the success is in the conversation. The people in which um, I'm out here, I, I know them, I've I seen them, and I know the struggle. People don't just build relationships, they're connected to resources, they're connected to jobs, they're connected to social resources. Mayor Arun in Arulampalam says he stopped by to the event a few times over the last nine months and applauds the work being done. For all of us who love this city, who care about the city, this should be really exciting. He also acknowledges there are a number of organizations working hard all over the city toward the same goal of nonviolence and hopes something can be learned from the success at the intersection of Barber and Earl Street. But there's so many community leaders here in the city of Hartford who are committed to this work, who really want to be a part of the hard work of healing trauma on the streets of the city. I did have a chance to speak with a member of the Hartford Police Department on the phone. They did confirm for me that fatal shootings so far this year citywide are down. There's only been four. That's less than at this point last year, but they didn't want to comment any further for this story. In Hartford, Kevin Geis, NBC Connecticut News.